Hello, today I will get to talk about collision deformer. How to use this? How this works? How many options this has? This collision is to do when both objects are close to each other. This how this is introduced how this works. But I can show you. It's, like, it's always better like to read documentation and study things, but sometimes people don't have time enough. I can modify this surface by using collision deformer. I, another, cool, another cool feature what I did, I can even assign a simulation tag rigid body. I guess, and now, what I, what if I use a, a collider? No, collider does not have this option. I just was thinking, if I can use this shape, uh, more dynamics, But it, actually, this is not a topic about a rigid body, but I, I just was interested if collision deformer can have rigid body. I guess we'll check because I'm really interested. No, this cannot work both. Okay, we can delete. Also, another thing what I was considering to use, check what we got here, because we got lots of options, relax, stretch, uh, size, stiffness, I don't know English word is correct, flex is to do with the formations. Oh, this is beautiful, wow. <laughs> but interaction between object is little bit not good enough. What can I do? Uh, I don't know if I can subdivide this model. Oh no, sorry guys, I didn't convert to a decable mesh. Now the deformation should be much better. I think playing uh, applies. No, I have to attach. No, because we have to move up this. I think I have to... Hmm. What I should put first? Hmm. Oh yes, now it works. You have to have proper order of modifiers. Sometimes it becomes for me annoying. I just was thinking if I can apply a uh, clock surface. This should give to us much better deformation. Yes, this is amazing. <laughs> you can create cloth and 
find other interesting things like uh, this could be optimized oh I can calculate oh no oh, nothing happens because we have got empty cache you can simulate this thing some advanced second focus to do with steps maybe it is to do with, with realistic simulation why this is inside oh I didn't know or you can do this as well inside uh, check inside the stretch wow looks great wow this is wonderful Okay, and what what is to the outside volume? Oh no, it's nothing happens. What if I scale this object? If I add segments and you should consider modeling by using this beautiful thing. Okay, I have to add some details to it. Maybe my collision deformer will be working much better. Don't forget you can off you can always use Hmm, did I cut polygons properly? In option subdivide, you can use smooth subdivision. But for in this case, hmm, I thought it will work something like. But this is because we have to add extra edges. And then we can subdivide this object in a proper way. I just was thinking about this. Subdivision wasn't really good. And I am. Something divide, uh, maybe I will leave like this. But calculation is a bit slower. Uh, okay, what I was thinking. Uh, relax. Oh, yes, this is great. This is wonderful. I didn't know I can change at the same time. Control D. Oh, what if I add another uh, object collider? Yes, you can use for modeling. You can create cushion by using this collider thing this is wonderful i like it i did not see this in blender wow this is beautiful stuff i really recommend it to you by considering using this because i really like this collision deformer actually if you change relax you will receive beautiful deformation you can 
but you can use it for animation. Wow, beautiful stuff. I hope you like this video. Bye.